that we are part of a, a international group based in Austria. There's a big drive from the group point of view to try, first thing, to try to be very conscious about green energy across the board. So, and then all, all our sister companies all over the world, they're trying to come up with concepts of trying to install some kind of alternative energy, not pure electricity from the coal. Other companies, they go into, you know, where there's enough water systems. Maybe some plants are sitting next to rivers, they would install a hydro system. So we thought, like, maybe where in Africa, where, what, what option could we look into, what's available? So the concept of, uh, of having the PV system came into being like, you know what, that could be something that you can do while the initiative is to try to save electricity. At the same time, let us just look at what is more usable and more green as a concept. And this is actually to fit with the bigger group, I mean, group thinking. The idea of looking into a PV system came into being and then we investigated. Then we got into discussion with the cyber cybernetics. Based on the, 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 because like I say, this was like almost like you can call it the experimental process. But with the, the theoretical assessment that they did with the computer I mean, simulation, I think we're talking in the region of about 40, 45% on a, on a daily average, 40% savings on electricity. But naturally, as you can expect, our plans work only five days. Over the weekend, is going to be excess usage. But on a, day, on a daily usage, I think we would actually be having about 40% 40, 40 savings, in a sense, of the normal daily consumption, which is quite substantial, I think, for us. This is a rooftop installation, grid tight system, so it doesn't work with batteries. Uh, it only works, it supplements with ESCOM. It's a 352 or 353 kilowatt system. The amount of modules is uh, 1,400 PV modules, each size at 250, uh, 55 watt. We use mainly SMA inverters, most of the bulk of the inverters are 17 kilowatt inverters. Um, we have smaller inverters as well to size according to that. Um, and we uh, estimate that we're going to save about uh, 570 kilowatt hours per year for the system. It could be more, uh, but that is, that is the, the conservative value that we have in, in mind. We size our system in a way that most of the energy that's being produced is used, okay? Because it doesn't help you have an oversized system and you throw it away either by degrading or, or reducing the output of the inverters. So we size it as, as far as possible according to their normal usage. Um, and if it so happens, like on weekends or vacation days where the energy feeds back, um, then we have a system in place just to decrease the output of the inverters so that it would supply what is necessary and not oversupply that would result in feeding back into the grid.